Okay, uh, we're gonna do this problem that was requested in the comments. It's from the 2006 AMC 10A Problem 17. I was supposed to do a couple of announcements for various different people. I, I gotta be honest, man, I'm running from my work to here. I've got five minutes till I have to start class. I work seven days a week, at least seven hours a day. I don't ever have a day off. So if, I'm, if I didn't get to your announcement that I needed to get to, I apologize. It'll come in a future episode or a future video. Uh, let's get to this one. 2006 AMC 10A Problem 17 in rectangle ADEH points B and C trisect AD and G and F trisect HE. So where is B and C? They're right here. They are trisecting this. So equal, equal, equal. That's what that means. And G and F trisect this. So those are all equal. Great. In addition, AH, that's here, equals AC, that's here, equals 2. Well, again, since this and this are equal, we know these must each be 1. It said it was trisected. It says this is 1. Furthermore, we know it's a rectangle, so we know the opposite side is 3. These are all 1 also, and this must be 2. What is the area of quadrilateral W, X, Y, Z shown in the figure? Okay, so it's kind of a messy geo calculation kind of thing. You just need to start finding pieces of information. If I know this, what do I know? For instance, when they told us AH was AC, your brain should have said isosceles right triangle, better way to say that, 45, 45, 90. Meaning this must be 45, this must be 45, and you know that's 90. Furthermore, we now know that this is 45 also. Okay, then what? Because AH is 2 and HF is 2, this is also a right isosceles triangle, making this 45. So I've got a 45 here and a 45 here. That makes this 90. It's a 45, 45, 90. Also, in addition, since this is 90 and that's 45, this angle is 45. This one is 45. And we already knew that this would come out to be 90. Also, Okay, let's go to the other side and see what we can find over there. 2 and 2 means that this is 45. How do we know it's, it's that? Again, this is a rectangle. The corners are 90 degrees, and these two angles have to be equal. Similarly, 2 and 2 here, that means this will be 45, and this will be 45. All right, so we've got 90 over here. We're going to have a 90 right here at W. All four corners of this shape are 90. At minimum, we know it's some kind of rectangle. Okay, then what can we say? We know that this triangle here, GYF, is similar to HZF by a 1 to 2 ratio. That means all the lengths are a 1 to 2 ratio. Then we would know that this here uh, is going to be equal to this. So ZY equals YF. We could find out what ZY is in that way. In the same vein, uh, we've got a 45, 45, 90 here and here, and it's also a 1 to 2 ratio. So this equals this. We in fact have a rhombus, but it's also got all 90 degrees being a rectangle, so it's a square. A square is the both a rhombus and a rectangle. It's both. So we have two ways to get this. All we have to do is get this length right here. I will divide by root 2. You have to know 45, 45, 90 is x, x, and x root 2. This is basic. This is fundamental. It's must know information. Divide by root 2 to get this. 1 over root 2 will equal root 2 over 2. I better just leave it as 1 over root 2, to be honest. Why? Because what are we about to do? Well, since this equals this, this will be 1 over root 2, as will this. The area of any square is going to be the product of its sides. 1 over root 2 times 1 over root 2 is, in fact, 1 half. The answer is going to be A. One other thing you might do as well, because this is 45, 45, 90 here, we could find, say, this length if we wanted to and verify that this is really going to work. I would divide 2 by root 2 um, to get 2 over root 2. Um, and then that's going to give me uh, root 2, basically. 
just divide the root two. You can just make this root two times root two. That's two also, right? Cancel root two. So this would be root two. And if we check this side, one over root two plus one over root two is, just as we had, two over root two. This serves as pretty strong confirmation. Our answer is correct. Got to go to work. See you guys in the next video.